is AD Video Editor, and this tutorial goes over the gradient map effect in Sony Vegas. So open up Sony Vegas, import some footage, click the effects icon, and get Sony gradient map, and click OK. And the first thing you'll notice are th these three circles at the top. And what they represent is a color. So if I set circle 0 here to a color and circle 1 to a different color, then those two color then everything in between those two colors will blend and have a gradient effect. And in case you don't know what gradient is, it's sort of the blending of two different colors. So what I'm going to do for this tutorial is set circle 0 to a let's say green and then set circle 1 to a blue and leave this circle on the end, circle 2, at where it was at default, being transparent. And so the way you can play around with this is, you see 0 has the green. So if I slide 0 over, you see the green begins to take over the blue until the blue is l almost nothing. And then if I were to, and then you can still see around the background here of the wall that it's still the normal color, sort of, because I still have that transparency in here. But if I bring circle 1 over, making more blue, dominate the transparency, you can begin to see how the background turns blue until there's literally no more transparency of it. So you can play around with these, trying to find how you like it with, the, um, with it. And you can always add more colors. So you can change circle 2 to maybe a red. And then if you double click this, you can add another circle. Or using these controls, you can add a circle, remove a circle, and then um, go to the previous circle that you were just at, or go to the circle, or go forward a circle. And then these buttons, these one, two on the end, will decrease and increase grading control at the position number. So you don't need to worry about those buttons too much, just focus on adding a circle and deleting a circle. So you see I now have four circles, so I can make zero on the end, let's say three on the end, then one and two equally spread apart. And if I make three, how about ye a yellowish color, or white even, you see how these blend together, so the green, then there's the gradient to the blue, which blends into the red, which blends into the right. And once you found something that you like, you can play around with these to how, however you like, um, then you have the amount. And I recommend keeping the amount at 1, because anything in between makes it look very gray and dullish until you get back to how your video was by default. So I would say keep it up at 1, and then your mode changes how it appears. So blend it pretty much just blends it all together, makes a pretty natural effect. And add will add the colors with some brightness to it, so it makes it appear more white and brighter. So I would say keep it at blend in case you found a good add that looks nice. And that is the gradient map effect. I hope you guys like this tutorial. Please remember to subscribe and like and comment. And if you have any questions, email me at ad.videoeditor at gmail.com. And please remember to watch my tutorials for the rest of the month.